What's going on, Poketubers? It's your boy, Mr. Firetime Pokemon. I got another completed set for you today. It's going to be the jungle set. So we're going to start off with the hollows first. We got Clefable. I really like the artwork in these original sets. Electro, looking very cool. Then we got one of the original EV Evolutions, uh, Flareon. Very, very nice card. The focus for you guys, I'm sorry. There we go, sorry about that. Okay, next we got another EV Evolution, Jolteon. One of my favorite Kanto Pokemon, Kangaskhan. Then we got Mr. Mime. I really like the background on that car, it's very cool. Very low HP Pokemon. Then we got Nido Queen. Nido King was in the base set. Really like the artwork on this page, y'all. Just like how its wings are uh, spread out like that, very cool. Then we got a Pinsir. The card that was probably the most sought after in this set was uh, this Scyther because it was actually a pretty decent card in the trading card game. Um, and since it's a jungle set, it was kind of based around you know, some grass Pokemon. Then we got Snorlax. I always like Snorlax. Um, he always can take a lot of damage, and then you know, if you put him to sleep, do rest, he'll go ahead and gain his HP back. Then we have the last of the original EV evolutions, Vaporeon. We got uh, Venomoth, Victory Bell, always makes me think of uh, the Victory Bell that James had that would always try to eat his face off. Then we have a Vile Plume, reminds me of uh, the, oh, the gym leader Erica. And then the last hollow in this set is Wigglytuff. So um, for the next three sets, so Jungle, uh, Fossil, and Team Rocket, they would show the same card, but then in non hollow form. So this is uh, Clefable, Electrode. You got a Flareon, Jolteon, Kangaskhan. You got a Mr. Mime, Nido Queen, a Pidgeot, Pinsir. Scyther, Snorlax, next page starts off with a Vaporeon, Venomoth, Victory Bell, Vileplume, Wigglytuff, I really like this artwork on this Butterfree, it's a really, really nice Butterfree, obviously Ash had a Butterfree, uh, he caught a Caterpie and it evolved. We got a Dodrio, Executor, thought that was a weird looking Pokemon with the different heads on it. We got a Fero, a Gloom, and we got a Lickitung, a Marowak. Next we got a Nidorina. A Parasect, a Persian, I always like this armor with the blue grass and the red tree, I thought that was really cool, looked like an alien planet or something. We got a Primate, Ash had one of those as well, a Mankey that evolved into a Primate. We got a Rapidash, very cool, a Rhydon. Next page we got a Sea King, really like that artwork on there. Tauros, I should have one of those as well. Sorry to get that to focus on the attack a little bit. There we go. Sorry guys. And we got a weeping bell. A bell sprout. Q bone. We got an Eevee looking adorable. Exec ex execute Goldeen. Then we got a Jigglypuff. That Jigglypuff was annoying in the anime. I was putting everyone to sleep. Okay, we got a Mankey. Next, we got a Meowth sitting on top of a payday. Very cool. 
uh, Nidoran, female. We got an Oddish, Paris, another Pikachu. Really like that cute Pikachu. Then we got a Rhyhorn, Spiro, Venonat. And the last card in the set is a Pokeball Trainer. So we'll go to the beginning again to show the hollows. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Um, like I said, this is uh, something new that I'm doing. Uh, I have completed seven sets so far, and I plan on making videos of all of them. And uh, anytime I complete a new set, I will go ahead and make a video of that as well. So thank you guys for watching, and uh, have a great day. Bye.